I definitely feel a history when I'm holding these cameras and wonder what they might have taken a picture of or who might have taken the pictures with them. These cameras represent some of the earliest access that everyday people had to photography. This is really the start for everyday photography. I imagine that these cameras have seen weddings, picnics, scenery, any image that took place outside of a studio. I was always interested in photography growing up. I became interested in wood and brass cameras by seeing them in museums and eventually ran into them for sale. I started collecting cameras probably when I was in graduate school. I was about 25 or so. I've specialized in cameras from 1850 through about 1930. It is mostly field view cameras. It's mostly wood and brass cameras. They're extremely large or extremely small. That makes them rarer and more interesting. Even though there are 500 of them, almost every one is different. My wife and I decided to donate this collection to UCR Arts because we knew that there was a museum here trying to tell people a story about photography. This donation from Larry is significant to the California Museum of Photography because it represents such a broad spectrum of the American field camera and really fills in a major gap in our own collecting history. People that see this collection should appreciate all of the designs and work and patents that went into making all of these variations in cameras and the workmanship that went into them to make them so beautiful. The museum will preserve them better than I could have done.